Patrick had a chance to talk to Lee Steinberg uh, yesterday at Radio Row. He said not only is he proud of you for the athlete, but for the man you are, what you do in the community. You're up for the player of the year, but you're also up for the NFL man of the year. Just talk about, you know, how the off the field stuff is just as important to you. Yeah, I mean, I was blessed to be in a lot of great communities growing up. I mean, at the end of the day, that's what gave me the inspiration to, to go back and give back as much as possible because I want kids to have the same opportunities that I had. And if it wasn't for the people I had around me, I wouldn't be sitting here. And so um, I, I, it doesn't matter if you want to be a football player or whatever you want to be. I want to make sure I give kids opportunities to go out there and be their best and achieve their dreams. And so that's why I, I care so much about giving back to the not only the Kansas City community, but every community that I, I was raised in. Speaking of kids, I have an eight-year-old son. Looks up to you. He's rolling out in the in the yard. Says he wants to be Patrick Mahomes. You know, what are your advice to those kids that that want to be Patrick Mahomes? Yeah, just follow your dream. Um, at the end of the day, don't uh, don't don't always listen to other people around you. Take the positives. Follow your dream. Um, I was told to not to quit playing football and to focus on baseball and other sports. And I, I was like, man, I want to give this thing a chance. And I, I kept playing. And, and even when I had one, I, I ended up getting one offer out of high school and. And, and then out of college, I to be a third-round third pick, and I just kept just following my dreams and working hard, and, and I'm sitting here today. So, I mean, just keep following your dreams. Last question real quick. I covered the Buccaneers a little bit as well. Tom Brady, when you were at that game, had high praise for you afterwards, said he thought the world of you. What does that mean to you? Almost a passing of the torch. You know, Brady, the GOAT, and, and you – you know, potentially on your way to be up there. Yeah, no, I think um, it's always great when you get it. Uh, you get positive advice and comments from Tom, man. He does. He did it the right way uh, for so long, man. Um, that's why he's he won seven Super Bowls. Is he worked his tail off, and he and he really and all his teammates loved him because of the way the man that he was. And so, anytime he gives me advice or or kind of reaffirms uh, the things that I'm doing, I take that. I take that, and, and it, it, it hits hard. And so I just try to make sure that I. I keep doing that stuff, and uh, hopefully one day that I can, I can get in my career. I can say that I'm, I'm somewhere close to that man right there. Well, what do you tell you? What do you tell you? No, I mean, I can't, I can't <laughs> say that. Nice me, man. But, uh, I, but uh, it's always great stuff, and it's always short and simple. But it means the world. Welcome to Parts Pass. I'm Stan, and I'm the founder. We created Parts Pass for anyone and everyone who owns a vehicle. It's free to use and free to download. Take a picture of your car. Our AI system will help decode it. Enter a part that you might need, submit an order, and have it shipped the next day. We would love for you to join our community. For do-it-yourselfers, car enthusiasts, and just anyone that owns a vehicle. Subscribe now, and we'll see you later.